Hi, Todd is here. We're gonna take a look at the weather uh, as we head into this busy weekend. If you're gonna head outside and if you are, do you need an umbrella? <laughs> a couple <laughs> questions. Yeah, yes um, and yes. <laughs> I don't know what the questions were. I was just saying yes. Um, anyway, good morning. We were a little, you could tell we were a little, uh, a little messed up there. I wasn't sure where I was. Goldie was a little off. Control room a little off. I think we're all a little off. It's Friday though. Weekend's right around the corner. We have some showers out there this morning. Uh, kind of a damp start with some misty spots, some foggy spots too. And this rain is starting to move into York County. Pick it up a little intensity here too for Rockingham County and parts of the lakes in New Hampshire. So it's gonna be a wet commute, especially for Southern Maine with this first batch of rain moving in. Nice to see this though again, nobody below freezing. So there's no slippery spots. It's just wet. You might have some puddles, but that's about it. We can do that. There's the low back to the west with more rounds of rain back here. So it's not gonna pour all day, but we'll have a few uh, chances as the day progresses. There's the first one moving through kind of wet out there with drizzle and showers, dense fog too, no ice concerns at all. Midday, this is probably when we get the steadiest of the rain for the majority of the state, especially for the mountains and central Maine. Coastline will be more scattered in nature. Temperatures though, once again, very mild for March, around 50 at the lunch break. And then this afternoon and evening, it actually doesn't look that bad to me. I think you're going to be like, whoa, this is really nice temperature wise. It's going to feel very balmy right through the evening. It would be awesome if there weren't going to be any rain showers around. You could spend all evening outside hanging out with friends, socially distanced, all good, right? But there will be some scattered showers and perhaps even some rumbles of thunder too. There isn't a huge severe weather risk, but there could be a few smaller gusts within any of those showers, downpours or rumbles that are out there. And then later this evening, colder air starts to bleed over the border and that changes some of the rain to snow and there'll be a couple of wet inches of snow across far northern Maine by early tomorrow morning. The storms out of here tomorrow. Saturday's the pick. It's cooler, but 45 to 50, so not bad. A bright, dry day with mildish air. Storm forming though in the jet stream there reforms along the coastline and this becomes a coastal, but it's a little too late in the game to lock in serious cold. And therefore, once again, while it's a more intense storm, we're looking at mainly rain out of this for all of the larger towns and cities. And it's probably a lot like an inch or slightly more. Now there will be snow. It will be snowing in the mountains. Uh, as you look here, first wave goes through tonight, a couple of slushy inches for the rooftop of the state. And then Sunday afternoon and Sunday night, there'll be about three inches here, maybe up to six inches of wet snow here. But notice nothing for Bangor, Waterville, Augusta, Lewiston, and probably not most of the Oxford Hills either. If we start off as a little bit of snow, it quickly goes to rain and kind of washes it out. Gale watches are up uh, for the storm tonight as it moves through and goes into the, the west wind, but seas today four to six, and we've got southwesterlies out there, so very choppy. Periods of rain in the 50s. Tomorrow's not bad, 45 to 50 with partly sunny skies. And then Sunday, cold rain mixed with some wet snow. Mountains will pick up a few inches of accumulation. Briefly cold and blustery on Monday, and then better for the middle of next week. Tuesday, Wednesday, we're back above 50 degrees with a chance for some more rain on Thursday, which is April 1st. Opening my day. My favorite month. Opening day. Opening day. It's your birthday month. It's my birthday month. It's your wife's month. birthday month. Yes, and my mother-in-law's birthday month. <laughs> and my son's birthday month. What, what is happening? It's also Sharon's birthday month. It's also Sharon's birthday month. Don't leave her out. What's happening right now? All right, let's get <laughs>